Well, well, look who's having questions regarding equips. Honestly, same. Despite this looking like a Xenoverse video, it is in fact about Dragon Ball Legends. I just like to spice things up, I guess. So let's begin with the reasons why you are here. As you may know, equipments can assist you on improving your unit's overall potential and stats. It may seem small, but any improvement is important. Equipments are divided into four rarities. Bronze, Silver, Gold and Platinum. Much like Zenkai's, you also have Zenkai versions of certain equips, which are called Awakened Equips, which are improvements and changes of the original stats of the equip. In regards to Bronze Equips, you shouldn't farm them because like hero units, they aren't viable. You should always try and focus on Awakened, Platinum and Gold Equips. However, if you have Silver ones, it's also okay. Some units can benefit from them, and if they have any Awakened version, then it becomes a bit better too. Within the equips, there are ranks of how strong and efficient they can be, so let's go through them real quick. There are in total 9 ranks Z, Z, S, A, B, C, D, E, and F. These can be divided as upgraded equips, which have pebbles on the 3 slots or you equips that only have one pebble on the first slot. Let's start with the new equips. F and D are horrible and you should never have them. If you do, just sell them. Don't spend any resources on upgrading them. Trash. <coughs> D and C are the best option, being C the better of the two. But not worth keeping them if they are an upgraded equip. This is very rare but can happen. Especially if you decided to upgrade equips that were F or E ranks. Now, the upgraded equips. A and B aren't optimal, but it can happen very often. If you have better versions of these equips, you can sell these. Z and S are the best to have on equips, and the minimum you should focus on achieving. Finally, we have Z+. This is the dream rank that everyone wants on their equips. But it's extremely difficult to pull, unless you are really lucky or the game gave some to you. So now the question may be, how can I farm and upgrade them effectively? Well, when you are farming for good equips, there are two things you need to focus on, and one of them is very important. The pebbles or stones, whatever you want to call these. These are very important. Pebbles can have three colors, green, yellow, and red pinkish. If you get an equip that has yellow and especially pink pebbles, keep it and try to max it out since they usually have higher stats than greens. Although you should always strive for the pink ones more than the yellow. However, the trickiest part of equips is to max them out to Z+. Equips are in my opinion the hardest part of this game, since it's based solely on luck and bad random number generator also known as RNG. You can re-upgrade equips, also called rerolls, by using slot removers, Zenny, and souls. You can also use chrono crystals, but I suggest to avoid spending them here. Although you can re-roll an equip 50 times or more and end up with the same or worse stats that you had in the beginning. This is why I say the RNG is really bad. I do advise spending slot removers mainly on Awakened and Platinum equips due to the overall better stats, but if there is a gold equip that you like and feel that it's perfect for your team, then feel free to try your luck. But again, only think of upgrading them if they have a yellow or pink pebble. The pebbles and stats are very, very important. Because even within pebbles, the stats changes. So we should always focus on the equip that has the better first slot. Because in this game, you cannot change the stats of the first slot. You are only able to change and upgrade the stats for slot 2 and 3. Slot 2 and 3 are the only ones you can reroll. The first one, the first slot, when you get it, is what you get it and there's no way to change it or improve it. Also. Never forget to check on who you can apply the equip on, by the way. Yes, because every equip has a condition to whom it allows to receive the stat boosts. Although, with so many equips, how do I know which one is the best? 
Well, unfortunately, that is up to you to discover. However, the less valuable stat is probably critical. Unless the unit is known to cost crits, even though you're still maybe better off focusing on strike, ultimate or special stats if you want to deal damage. Every unit has your own kit and specialization. Analyze and find out what the units need or lacks and compensate or boost it with the equips you see fit. The final question and the hardest response is, where can I get these equipments? Well. Most of these equips can be found on the Equipment Shop, Equipment Collection, the Metal Shop for equips that were available through PvP, and a variety of events and shop events. For Awakened equips, you can find them on the Ultra Space Time Rush Shop, and sometimes you can also have Golden equips. However, the OSTR mainly focuses on Awakened equips. You can also get one Android specific Awakened equip on the Co op shop. So this is all I have to say about equips and how you can improve or even get them. If you found this video to be helpful, don't forget to drop a like and share it with your friends. For any additional questions, feel free to write a comment or join our Discord, link is in the description. If you want more tutorials or to see other content that I make, don't forget to subscribe and ring the bell. I hope to see you guys on my next video and stay tuned for them, my friends.